Hello guys, welcome back. This is Dr. Hadi here. Today's topic is from biochemistry. That is units of enzyme activity. Before we start this topic, I would like to tell you, do you know what is the unit of mass? Just like in ordinary life, we say the unit of mass is kg, kilogram. A little bit smaller mass uh, unit is gram and more smaller unit milligram more smaller unit microgram nanogram and so on these are the units used for the mass and now the unit of length is kilometer a bigger unit small unit is meter centimeter millimeter, micrometer, nanometer and so on. Just like these physical quantities have their units, similarly for enzyme we also use units. But there are two ways by which we express enzyme in terms of units. To express enzyme we have two options. Number one, to express enzyme concentration, we simply use milligram, microgram, 10 milligram of enzyme, 200 milligram of enzyme. This is okay. This is just concentration. Asking about the activity of enzyme, in other words, if you want to express the enzyme activity, then this also have its own units. So the activity of enzyme cannot be expressed in terms of milligram or microgram, but for activity of enzyme, we express, we use other units like cattle and international unit international and a a l international unit iu and cattle before i start uh, um, expressing about international unit or cattle i would like to to say something about activity what is activity look when a person is doing something some job in his or her life we say this is his or her activity I am reading a, a, a book, this is my activity. So what, what duty, what job I am performing is my activity. So in terms of enzyme, what could be the activity of the enzyme? Activity is the job of the enzyme. What the enzyme does? Look, you have a substrate, you have something, you have reactant, and this substrate is going to convert into product and you know how the substrate is converted into product this is by the help of enzyme fine so by the help of what by the help of enzyme so this is the duty of the enzyme to convert substrate into product and one thing more there also happens some uh, there is also an idea of time the activity, the task, the duty of the enzyme takes some time. Means when the substrate is converting into product by the help of enzyme, then it takes some time. So in particular time, the conversion of substrate into product by the help of enzyme is the activity of enzyme. So I'm very, very glad to tell you, very happy that we got the idea of the activity. Once you got the activity, you will be able to learn the unit of enzyme activity. So first of all, come to the, the first unit of enzyme activity that is international unit. When you take some vials, bottles of enzyme, the bottles, some small vials, vials, small type of bottles that contain enzyme, you might see uh, 200, 100 IU international unit instead of 200 gram, 200 milligram, you may see this international unit. So this is a really good 
to see on the label of that uh, container the international unit so what is this this international unit <clears throat> international unit is that amount of substance that amount of enzyme which is required to convert one micromole of substrate into product in one minute so here i would like to uh, i would explain in more simple words i just need your focus uh, the, the very first thing is we need amount of what enzyme and second thing we need substrate like i have discussed substrate how much substrate one micromole of substrate so when you use substrate there must be some substrate the uh, substrate may be in one mole two mole one millimole just like these are the units of mass so the unit of concentration is mole millimole micromole so what i have mentioned we use substrate in mole rather than using one milligram of substrate two milligram of substrate in biochemistry or chemistry we express the quantity in terms of mole and i have a very good lecture on concept of mole as well i think you know this what that that what is mole so substrate is taken in mole one mole two mole three mole one micromole two micromole and so on so when you take one micromole of a substrate and then convert this micromole into product in how much time in one minute that quantity of enzyme will be called to have one international unit activity one nation uh, let me explain suppose <clears throat> you have one mole of a substance suppose you have one mole of substance and that is equal to 50 gram suppose uh, i said that we use mole instead of gram so any substance has a mass so this is the mass of that substance yeah the substrate 50 gram is the mass of the substrate and it is equal to one mole now if i want to take one millimole rather than one mole mole is a, a, a large unit big unit so I, I want to take small unit of mole small unit of mole is millimole just like milligram gram milligram so small unit of mole is millimole one millimole of a substance would be 50 million just convert 50 gram into milligram so if you take 50 milligram it means that you have taken one millimole of that substance one millimole of that substance furthermore if you want to take more smaller quantity means one micromole just like here microgram is smaller than milligram so if you want to take one micromole so for one micromole just convert this 50 microgram uh, that's 50 milligram into my mi microgram into what into microgram 50 microgram so you, you take 50 microgram of that substance that will be automatically equal to one micromole so if you, if you take 50 milligram this will be one millimole and if you take 50 gram this will be one mole i can give you one more example i suppose you have another substrate and it's um its mass is its mass is one mole is equal to 200 gram suppose it's a 200 gram so if you want to get one millimole one small m one millimole of that substance you you will take 200 gram or milligram so just take milligram from gram to milligram this is one millimole and if you want no i i want to take one micromole so you can take one micromole just take 200 microgram so this was just to explain what is micromole so here is the equation suppose uh, you have one micromole substrate substance or substrate suppose this is one micromole 
and you want to convert this quantity of substrate into what into product of course it will take some time in one minute the time is equal to time is equal to one minute one minute now of course you will add enzyme you will add enzyme this is some amount of enzyme maybe maybe if the enzyme is in liquid form maybe you add one ml enzyme maybe you add one milligram of enzyme whatever quantity you add this specific quantity of enzyme that is required to convert one micromolar product in in, in one minute then this quantity this quantity of enzyme is said to have this quantity of enzyme is said to have is said to have one one international unit activity now this is very necessary it is very essential very imperative to say that this quantity of enzyme is said to have one international unit activity okay so that was the uh, concept of international unit here now we will come to another unit that is cattle there are other units as well like uh, king armstrong unit okay so these two units are uh, very well famous in our textbooks cattle is another unit of enzyme activity but here again the amount of enzyme like just like the amount of enzyme needed to convert one mole here we have just one mole here we have one micromole but here one mole of a substrate into product in one second so here the time is one minute but here the time is one second this is a large unit of enzyme activity here you will take uh, one mole of substrate and you will convert it into product into product in how much time in just one second so if you want to convert one one mole is a very uh, large amount of substrate large amount of substrate is compared to one millimole so very large amount of substrate the time is very less so in very less time converting large amount of substrate into product require again specific concentration of enzyme so you will add specific concentration of enzyme that is required to convert one mole into product in just one second if that amount is unable to convert one mole in product in one second that this amount could not be called one cattle that specific amount should convert one mole in one second not in two seconds in three seconds in one second then you can call that this quantity then you can call this quantity to have one cattle activity now you will say this quantity is said to have one cattle activity one cattle activity so of course this is actually the concentration the amount of enzyme but this amount of enzyme is said to have the activity of one cattle so this was the uh, whole lecture about the units of enzyme activity i hope you got that idea see you in the next lecture of the biochemistry we have almost completed this chapter of enzyme almost 26 to 30 video lectures have been recorded from enzyme our next target will be uh, vitamins chapter once we finish this chapter and some two or three topics left behind once these topics are finished and then we'll proceed to the next chapter till then bye bye